Hey guys, Roadkill Gerbil again. So this video is about what should you spend your gems on. Um, this one's going to be very short and simple, okay? Um, it takes a lot of gems to get up to um, your academy level 25. Academy level 25 is where you get T4 troops, which we really, really, really want. So, um, you need to be saving as many as possible of your gems for uh, the building materials. I strongly recommend that the first of the buildings that you really focus on for the building materials is the uh, treasure trove. Okay, as soon as you as soon as you possibly can, you want to get at least ten thousand gems in there on a thirty day turnaround. Okay, so for those of you who haven't got a treasure trove yet. It's like a bank, okay? You um, put, you deposit your gems for ideally 30 days, um, and then you get back your gems plus more gems. Woohoo! Not a lot like my bank account then. But anyway, um, so the higher your level of your treasure trove, the uh, more gems you get back, and the more gems you can put in. So more gems in and you get a higher proportion of them back. It's fantastic. Um, so that's what your crystal pickaxes are for and you want to get that up to level nine as quickly as you possibly can. So as soon as your castle goes up a level, the next thing that should go up is your treasure trove. Your treasure trove should be full at all times. Um, yeah, there's just, there's no reason not to. Okay, so as if you're just starting out or you haven't got your treasure trove yet, you are saving up to have at least 10,000 gems. Okay. Um, once your treasure trove is where, you know, as far up as you can get it, I would say the next place is into your um, war tomes for your battle hall. Now, it's a little bit more negotiable with this one um, because obviously we have um, people like. Sirius and Nikki, who are just fantastic at this, and so their battle halls are insane. Um, so if we have a rally where we really, really, really need people, um, they're the ones we're going to turn to, pretty much obviously. But I would say that you still want to get your battle hall up as high as you can as soon as you can. Um, it makes it easier for you to contribute um, to the guild, and yeah. Generally, good thing. Um, I would say the next one is your prison. Okay, so that's your steel cuts. Um, and uh, yeah, so you don't need to get all of these up to maximum before you move on to the next one, but this is where your gems should be going. Okay, um, so yeah, get some steel cuts. Um, I can't help smirking. Um, and upgrade your prison again just as high as you reasonably can. Um, and the last one will be your soul crystals. Okay, so that will then get you your altar. Um, I haven't even started that one yet because my prison isn't high enough level, so I can't really talk too much about that. Bear in mind that you are going to be looking at well over 200,000 gems in total upgrading all of this stuff. Um, you will also need to have um, uh, golden hammers. So every car, every uh, building that you upgrade to level 25 will take a golden hammer. Okay. Um, now all of these things, your golden hammers, your crystal pickaxes, all of those can be bought individually, but they can also be bought in packages. So, for example, you can get, um, I think it's, I think it's kind of 150 gems for um, the 10 crystal pickaxes or something, um, uh, or it's 10,000 gems for a thousand. So it's much, much, much better to get your crystal pickaxes and all of these things in the largest bulk that you can, because that's going to work out the cheapest overall, and you're gonna have to you know, you're gonna have to buy tons of them. So buy in bulk, okay? Um, 
it that really is going to make a huge difference. Um, so yeah. Other than that, uh, obviously you don't want to be spending all of your gems on that because it's really boring. Okay, trying to get up to trying to get all everything up to level twenty five is just something of a grind. So um, you can use gems for speed ups. Uh, yeah, I try and avoid that. Um, I know there there are times when you just can't help yourself. Um, willpower fail. That's fine. But I would never use them for speeding up troops. Okay, troops die. Troops die a lot, um, especially with us seemingly. Um, so it's worth just it, it, it. There's no point spending gems on those. Um, the one place that I do think it's worth spending gems every now and again is on some of the brave hearts. Um, I'm gonna go I'm gonna do another video in a little bit about how important the brave hearts are and how useful they are. Sorry, how how important the heroes are. Um, and brave hearts will help you to get your heroes up to those kind of legendary levels much, much faster. So it is worth buying a few brave hearts once your VIP level is high enough that you'll run that you uh, that you don't have enough stamina throughout the day to use up all of your um, elite level attempts on your heroes. Okay, um, I'll go into that in more detail when I talk about heroes. Okay, um, but yeah, so nice and simple. Save as many gems as you can for building materials, even though it's boring. Um, Spend a few on some brave hearts and yeah, enjoy. Um, treasure trove, treasure trove, treasure trove. It's that's the biggie. All right, okay, talk to you soon.